What is going on, everybody? What is cracking lacking? So, kind of go over some apparatus of tools and tabs. And Where's my other mini lifter here? My lift right here. Where the heck did I go? <clears throat> we'll do that one next time. So, I don't know where I put that. So, anyways, what I end up doing is um, taking this hammer and hitting the uh, side of the panel with this uh, leather hard tip. Uh, you can see we got we got a, a nice little sharp couple dents in there. All right, here's the eighth inch lines on them. Just to give you an idea, sixteenth inch spacing. Um, so here's some 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 tools I like to use just just in case just for your reference. Some of you guys I have seen this before, and but check it out. I actually really like this. Uh, this adapter that goes on any of the slide hammers here. This is a mint, this is a uh, fast PDR slide hammer. Uh, it's, it's been fantastic so far. This is from Cam Auto. It just screws on because this doesn't have a pass through. So this screws on. And the benefit of this one is that it's a pass through as well. So you pull it back, it's spring loaded. And then when you pop it on the tab, it locks on there. So when you, when you yank, that you don't lose the tab. And again, if you only have a horseshoe adapter on one side, then this is this is a great, a great addition. Um, so you can get this on Cam Auto too as well. And if you're dent training, remember you are you can save some money there too as well. So they they are a, um, a vendor now. So the tabs. The reason why I was telling you guys about these, the latest tabs I have right now, and we're gonna use some of the glue too. I'm just gonna get that out of the way is the reaper tabs and you probably there's probably been talk about that already awesome uh, awesome tabs we're going to show you how they work and the dead on dead on dent center tabs right here so friggin they both pull like a monster so and then we're going to be using the tequila glue and here's the dead in the package dead on dent tools okay dead center dent tabs Fantastic. I did have the first version. They stretched, but these things look like they have really, they really beefed them up. So, uh, yeah, they look, uh, and people are like, all right, all right, how many tabs do I need? Well, if you're a seasoned veteran tech, dude, you're going to probably want as many tabs, different variety tabs as you want. That's, that, that's just the way to go. And, and if you want stuff that doesn't that that's not going to uh, break, that's not going to happen. And the stronger the tab, I think, basically, the the more likely it will break. But that's another topic too. You could you could charge for these things, man. So you know, I charge more for glue pulling uh, because it takes more time. I'm using material, obviously, and there's chances it could break. So that is something now to really consider doing a lot but in, anyways enough of the talking right you guys want to see what's what's crack a lacking around here oh and by the way really quick um magnetic this is the best one of the best spray bottles ever for alcohol let me get my uh where's my little stand i guess i wasn't prepared on this one here we gotta clean up around here too I mean, dang it, you're getting lazy, man. You need to clean up. <laughs> All right, so really, uh, in this particular, when, I, when I'm when i using uh, a, a, a dent like this, I like to, uh, I really like to prefer to use a mini lifter because it, 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 it really pulls, shall I say, more aggressively. All right, oops, let me just put this on here and I'll stop moving the camera around for you guys. Anybody comment about the footage and all that crap, then you know what? Can't complain about free content, dude. Free is free. This ain't Mike Toledo production here. I don't know what you guys are thinking. <laughs> so I'm gonna prep that panel. We're gonna go, you know, Re the Reaper's gonna get one dent and the, uh, the dent on center tabs are gonna get another dent. So we're gonna, we're just gonna practice and see what happens, all right? So I don't like to go with a huge, like something like this. I, that's just too big for me personally. I, I like to pull a little bit smaller. 
that's just my preference but you'll see why and maybe yeah, maybe I'll zoom in for you a little bit too as well how's this what glue is your all-around you like to use mmm dude let's toss it up dent zero um, whatever's in my in my gun because generally it, it works okay um, Man, you got your hog glue, you got your tequila glue, you got your tab weld, you got your extreme purple, your cactus green. I'm just naming a few that work. Obviously, the tequila glue we're gonna use right now. All right, so I'm just gonna put a little there. I will try to read the comments as much as possible. Look, I'm not gonna put that much glue either, okay? My objective is what? To pull that center up without pulling the shoulders up. That's, that's my objective. I love this, this mini lifter too right here. This is the Robo lifter. It's got a pass through on here. And one, two, three. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> Hi, look at the mountain it just pulled right here, dude. That thing is just oh, wow. one and done, dude. All right. Now, some people would say that is just way too high, Mike. I mean, would not, why would you pull it that high? Listen, I don't like to mess with this stuff. Can you give me your peewee tap down too, by the way? Well, the reason why I like to tap down uh, so high is because I like to see there's no center left in it. So I'm going to bring this in just a, just a hair. I'm going to turn this board over and we'll zoom in a little bit. Okay. That is super high okay i might have a tiny bit of a low there but we'll see we'll see by the way <clears throat> i'm using a uh, purple heart paddle from tequila let's make sure i'm not there Freaking good. <laughs> That's my way. That's the way I like to do it, okay? It's just, you know, everyone has their own techniques, right? I just, I think, personally, I just, I don't mind tapping down, right? Because glue pulling, glue pulling makes you a good tap down person. And when you have the right chips, this is, look, my favorite ones are VIP and dead center, uh, dead on dent. This is a peewee dead on dent match grade you can get it on anson you can get all these products at anson if you if you are thinking about purchasing stuff like this but this is what helps keeps me clean and keeps my my repairs quicker faster and cleaner this is why i preach this, this is why i say this on dent trainer over and over again okay so let's back this up we'll go on the white this time that was the yellow i still got a tiny bit here but you know i'm not going to worry about the little flaws this is just a demonstration this ain't a strict training tutorial this is not what this is meant for all right so now let's go um reaper okay i'm gonna prep that panel reaper tab and by the way if you want to see that glue tab again i, I did i did a drop somewhere but anyways it's it, it was i don't know where i put it but this is what it looked like okay it was smaller that was the dead dead, dead center dent tabs now we got a reaper tab now this isn't as, as as large but we're gonna see how how much i can pull with this smaller reaper tab this is this is it right here okay you can tell i've been using it already i'm gonna prep it one more time because that's important tech tip when you do glue pulling have a system where you put stuff constantly in the same spot okay if you like to put this here on the panel then leave it on the panel but do it every time that way you're not looking for your stuff constantly like i do okay? <laughs> it's just word of some advice all right so we're gonna go with that 
to keel it glue again. Okay, as you guys can tell that I do not, I don't wait very long. And I push it pretty, pretty hard. Okay. 1001, 1002. Let me move that bottle out of the way. Set this up. Ooh, get that in the middle. Get the feet, get a little tension. One, two, three. Good pull. Can you hand me that tab? I'm gonna keep losing tabs. I'm dropping two bucks on the ground, man. I don't don't like to drop two two bucks on the ground and leave it. Booyah. Okay, so we've got a pit. Now this is the, this is a technique too as well. In case you want to check it out when you have something like this, and I like to open this up. Jaime, this is especially for you, and you've been practicing this, perfecting this, shall I say? So I'm gonna just shallow that dent up, right? Set it up, dude, right? No pinching, no, no pinching, no tightness. Okay. Prep that panel one more time. All right. We're still gonna go back to the small one right here. This isn't the smallest. I think it, well, maybe, I don't know. I, I could say, I gotta look at that. John, you can, if you're watching, you can chime in on this, dude. All right. Might have smaller ones than that. Okay. I prepped the panel, right? Come up. This is giving you a nice little demo. I will save this video. I'm probably gonna put it on YouTube as well. I'm not as, uh, well, we'll talk about that later, but one, two, three. Oh, shoot, that pulled harder than the first time. Okay, I wasn't expecting that hard pull. I guess we're gonna see how good I tap down, dude. I think that center's done. <laughs> so the question is, I guess, like, is it worth buying, right? Or purchasing, and, and hell yeah, it is, dude. You know? Dude, if it does that for me, in one to two poles on a sharper dent, I'm in. I'm in like Flint, man. All right. I'm in like Flint. Machine. In and out like a robbery. That's what we say. Okay. That's pretty much how we do it, okay? That's pretty much what that proves the point of, uh, of these tabs. So, do they work? Absolutely, I think you're gonna really like them uh, between that, that tequila glue, right? Make sure your glue is super hot. You see, I don't wait very long. And I am in, I am in, uh, in uh, beautiful Fantasy Island, uh, perfect weather, San Diego. So your variations might different, okay? Might be different for there, okay? Someone asked what light. Oh, someone asked what light. I, I get that question every time. So let me, yeah, I guess so. Let me switch. So this is a version one from a limited. Okay, it's the Mike Toledo version. So if he doesn't have it on site, you can ask for it. I don't think he makes version ones anymore, but he will make. He has something. James is fantastic at customer service, so get a hold of him. I'm using a pole system from Ultra Dent Tools. I've had these are extra things I got from uh, Guitar Center, and I made some things. I got some 
I got a, another tray from Amazon. I got a tip holder from from uh, Anson. Freaking legit. Love it, love it. And the the part that makes the the light stand on the pole is the Medusa adapter again from Eliminat. But again, you can get uh, most of this stuff at Anson. So if you want to do a one-stop shop or if you want a custom light. And, uh, but Ultra has, you probably have to buy that from Ultra itself. But, and the glue gun, a limited, okay. And Robo lifters from Kiko. Okay. And by the way, Kiko does manufacture those tabs. So you know you're gonna get a high-end product here. And then this was the, um, this was the fast PDR. We didn't use the slide hammer, but I'm just showing you some little options there. Okay, if this is the rail situation, I'd be using that all day long. So, all right. Let me know if you have any questions on that. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, Friday, glue pole Friday day. So, all right.